brain. I don't know. Where's the... Okay. Don't take any steps. <laughs> okay. Um, all right. So the first thing that you're going to need to do uh, when you're preparing and setting up for the on-ramp session before the person gets here um, is getting the TV set up. So whether you're using the screen at the front or if you're using the screen in the corner here, um, you'll first pull up the on-ramp tracking sheet, which is this spreadsheet here. Now, first thing you're going to need to do once you have this open is actually create a table, a specific table for them. So you want to click on the five session on ramp template. You're going to, oh, I'm not, we're not signed in here. So you'll have to be signed in onto the BTV uh, account so that you can actually edit the document. But once you're good there, you're going to duplicate the five session template and you'll get a thingy down here that says copy. And then here you'll rename it and you'll put in the person's name. And so you'll see down at the bottom here, we have like a bunch of ones that are previously used. Um, and that just keeps them nice and divided so you know who you're working with. Now on this sheet, you can also double click the date and you can put in the date that you're working with them on, again, just to kind of track it across the board. Um, as far as setting up the list of work to do, you're gonna click on the little session number one out of five or two out of five or three out of five, whatever day you're working on. And that opens up a link to the Canva document. And it's just a nicer way of looking at the uh, content for the class for the client. So you'll notice the on-ramp spreadsheet is, it's kind of cluttered. There's a lot of text. This is really for you as a coach to kind of read through. There's demo videos and other infographics here for you to use. But this is a lot easier way for the client to kind of understand what's happening in the class. Um, it's simple language. It's uh, big text so it's just a little bit easier for them to, to digest versus looking at the big um, the big uh, spreadsheet with all the small text on it so one other thing I want to talk about here is if we are creating the tab for our client we'll want to also add their bio and just notes about them so that we can get to know the client before they walk in so what we're gonna do here is we can grab them by going into Zen Planner, staff login. From here, we would log into our account and then we would search the client's name. I'm just going to pull one from a uh, client uh, in their account under the notes section. So we would go see all notes. From here, you're going to see basically the notes from their no sweat consultation. So I can click on this, copy this data over, go back to the sheet, and then I can just paste the data in here. So this can be helpful for yourself. Oh, that didn't go through. Yes, it did. A little disjointed, but. Uh, basically what this is going to do is just give you access to notes on the client. So maybe what their occupation is, where they live, how they heard about us, their injury history, training history, and other interesting facts about the client. So this can just be helpful in building rapport with the client. So again, we go into Zen Planner, under the client's account. In their account, we go to the notes section see all notes and then we can copy paste that over so that'll be useful for you as well as any other coaches who are working with this client here we're good so the only other thing we want to do prior to the session is we want to go into our zen planner front desk which um, if you log into your zen planner account it's going to be this little icon in the top corner that will bring you to the front desk and then for the onboarding session, I would just scroll down here till I find this specific onboarding session. Beside the client's name, I would simply hit the check in button to confirm that they showed up for the ses session. So that's really all you'll need to know for starting up the screen and getting ready technically for the session.